Hey Leo, welcome on my channel, Triple Chew Tarot. I'm going to do your April 2021 general love reading. What's happening in your life, career, overall in your life? What's the growth of your life? What you can expect uh, in your love, career, and overall for the next month? This is a monthly tarot reading prediction. So keep an open mind. This is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. You can book a personal reading from me if you want it. Check out the description box for all the personal and private reading. Contact me on my email address and Instagram link is given. So only through this proper way. Uh, be, be careful, be alert from the scammers if you're new on my channel. Don't try to approach these peoples. I'm, I will be not responsible if you're going to reach out to these peoples. Be careful. Only contact me through my email address and Instagram link. That is given on this channel and in the description box, okay? Energy could be reversed, flipped. Um, so just take what resonates with you. It's a general reading. Sun, moon, rising in Leo or any planets. Let's see what's happening in your life. And then I will check up what are you doing up to. What's happening in your life? Five of cups reverse, four of pentacles reverse. Okay, letting someone go. Two of swords. Eight of cups reverse. Yeah, this is something you don't have a clarity on things. So you're moving on. This is your energy right now. Good. Moving on. Bottom of the deck tower. So some of you, this could be uh, Aries or Scorpio or someone like a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that you're connecting with. Could be another fire sign, water sign, earth, air, all the signs are here. But Aries, Scorpio, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Look, with the tower card, you're breaking the chain with someone. You're letting the past go with the Eight of Cups, Five of Cups, and Four of Pentacles. Erased. This is someone that you have been holding on for a long time. And finally, you're closing the chapter with this person. You're letting this completely, this person go completely um, from the past. Whoever this person is, because you're not in a contact with, or this is someone who's making you confused. Like, you don't know. You have no clarity on this situation. This could be someone who's a deceptive or playing the mind games with you. With the moon and the two of swords. Like you don't have clarity on this. This is like an illusion. You're living on the crossroad with this person. So with a knight of pentacles, slowly but surely you're moving on from this person because you want success. You want someone that who can recognize you, who can publicly or officially or in a community, you know, tell other people like we are together. This is not like a mind games or secret things and, you know, someone is not always coming and go in your life and you're like, no, I don't want this type of a relationship. I want something that is solid. I want something that people know about us, know about relationship. But this could be you, Knight of Pentacles and Six of Pent Six of Wands, working on your success, working on your money, your achievements. You could be getting some type of public recognition too, coming out of your show, showing your creative side this month, okay? Now let's see who is coming towards you in love, Leo. Who is this person? Okay, we have the King of Cups. Five of Swords. This could be someone who has a high ego, but I would not say high ego. This is someone who is a player, like with the King of Cups, Knight of Cups, and Five of Swords. This is someone who is spreading their love everywhere. Mm. Just saying, just saying, just saying. No offense. Yeah, Six of Cups and the Three of Pentacles. This could be someone you know from the past. Yeah, this is someone that you know from the past. Six of Cups, like someone that you worked with, with the Three of Pentacles. You used to be colleagues, co-workers, studied together in education or someone that you know from a childhood. Um, you know this person. This could be someone that you have a babies with, with the Six of Cups. Does not have to be. But yes, you make the babies with this person. And this person, Nine of Cups, hmm, this is someone that you like and you want to be with them. You wish to be with them. This could be someone that you're wishing that come back to you. This could be someone from the past that you're wishing that you should be together or reconcile with each other. Um, with the King of Cups and Five of Swords came up together. So this is someone that, like, um, they have a mood swings. This is also someone, like, processing from their ego. Like, they want to win at any cost. If they put someone, like, if they like someone, they just get it. This is that type of person. So this person has a lot of options or they could be used to be player. They, they just like you can't trust this person. Again, this person, you can't trust this person. Like this person, whatever this person likes, they just get it. So this person could have a lot of affairs or options or whoever they like, they just get it. 
and they're like and now they're like you they want to be with you this could be someone from the past like you know them like you know this person habit you know this person queen of pentacles yeah you are uh, working on the, your healing you're working on your your finances you could be wishing um to be with someone you could be wishing for someone that who can you have a solid connection with you could be single mother watching this video you're wishing to be with someone that who can heal you who can accept you who can give you family who can work with you and this is someone who is coming maybe interested in you and you don't know i feel like you don't know who this person is like with the moon card you don't have clarity on this person completely so i feel like you need to know this person past history if you know who this person is this is someone who is re-entering in your life with a full card. With a six of cups and full, it's a reconciliation. Yeah, you used to date this person. You used to wish for this person with a nine of cups and star. This could be someone that who is your inspiration. You like him, like her. Uh, you feel like you wish to be with this person, by the way. And this person is coming now. This is someone who is your wish. And wish granted, Leo. Someone that you have been wishing for. Someone that you wanted to be with. Yeah, Nine of Swords. This is someone um, you're obsessively thinking about or they are obsessively thinking about you. Nine of Wands. Oh my God, player energy. And we have the lovers. Yeah, this is someone. Eight of Wands. This person has a restless energy. With the Eight of Wands. They're coming uh, to see you, want to be with you. They want to talk. This is someone who's a talker. They want to talk to you. This could be someone coming from the far. Or this could be a long distance relationship like online meeting does not have to be um okay gemini energy here we also have aquarius we have aries i'm also getting taurus capricorn vibes and a lot of water here pisces cancer scorpio but this could be a air or earth sign to anyone look knight of wands this could be someone you already know. There's a two people coming in your way, by the way, Leo. We have the Knight of Cups. This is someone you may be right now talking or you are going to meet this person. Are you right now in a texting and talking and getting to know each other in the period of getting to know each other in the process of trying to see this person, trying to get to know, or maybe you're liking this person. This is like your crush with a star card, someone that you're crushing on. You want to talk, you're texting them and they're not talking. There are maybe They have a lot of options maybe and you know it. This is someone that you're wishing to date with or wishing to be in relationship with. There could be an age gap too between you and this person. Okay, and there is someone with an eye of wands coming back to you from the past. Someone that is a player energy. Like they used to be with you. And this is someone who, who left you out in the cold. They ghosted you and wanted to return. From nowhere, this is someone who's re-entering in your life with the full card. This is someone you know, okay? They left you out in the cold and may, you maybe try to move on from them or maybe right now trying to move on. And when you have a two people are talking to someone and boom, this is also someone coming from the past. Now with the nine of cups and the lovers, now you have a choice between two people like who you want to be with. The new person or the someone is coming from the past. So you have an option in love between two people. Uh, and I feel like you both like these people. Like at some point you like this past person, but you try to move on because they they hurt you they left you out in the cold without even telling you they just left and now they're returning without even your permission and now there is someone else with the queen of pentacles and star you're wishing for you're wanting to be with or there is someone who who maybe likes you and want to date you and showing you the interest and now you are like what should i do and the nine of cups and lovers i feel like you need to follow your heart desire whoever you feel the close with or feel you if you like the person but with the lover's card, I definitely feel you have option between two people, two lovers. One is one is the person who likes you and there is someone that you like, but they left you and now they wanted to return. Or maybe you still wanted to hold on to this person and you will still have a hope that you will be together. You're wishing for that person. But I'm also seeing that there could be someone that liking you and want, wish to be with you, wish to date you. And I feel that this is that person. So now it's up to you who you are going to choose and who you are going to be with. Because I'm seeing there's a two people here, to be honest. This could be the one you already met the romantic partner. Yeah, this could be someone that you used to date and coming back to you. You used to have a honeymoon with this person. Or this could be the child of your, the father of your child or mother of your children coming and re-entering in your life. Yeah, soulmate. This could be someone that you have a soul connection with, the star card, obviously, soulmate connection. 
you have been on a retreat with this person and now they're coming and re-entering but there is someone who wants to get to know you and like you so the question is who you are going to choose romantic feelings someone someone is maybe going to reveal that how do they feel they have romantic feelings yeah you could be waiting for someone else but there is someone else who is interested in you and want to date you and wanted to get to know you yeah this is someone who's wanted to express their love because they're very very attractive to you leo or this could be you you are very very attractive to someone but someone coming from the past in the way interesting it looks like a love triangle for me yeah wedding rings this could be someone coming from the past or maybe a new person someone want to marry you someone is picking up their truth how do they feel it's an abundance it's lightning it's unexpected yeah this is unexpected whoever they are returned this is unexpected this this uh revelation of truth or this expression of love someone like someone is interested in you and want to be with you it is going to shock you with a lightning and abundance but this is abundant like someone who is ready to be with you you can have a long-term partnership with someone is definitely speaking up their truth it is going to shock you the way this person is going to approach you it's it is going to shock you i don't know i'm getting like it's a shocking for you like you're going to be shocked like you know maybe you don't have any idea like who this person is right now but this person is maybe secretly wanting to be with you and they're just going to like going to express it from nowhere and you were like what let's see love message for you we have number 13 miracles and blessings everything has its gifts yeah it, it's a gift it's abundant it's a gift from the god and universe for you because you deserve this or this could be someone from the past from nowhere come back to you and wanted to marry you and want to be with you and you're going to be shocked like really yeah this is someone who's going to shock you whoever they are you're going to be shocked like this person this revelation of truth or this expression of love a confession of love from someone is going to shock you i'm telling you this is going to shock you this is a miracle and blessing on the way so this is your reading like share and subscribe i will see you in the next video bye